Well, there's another empty stall at the Kentucky Horse Park tonight following the death of champion thoroughbred Point Given on Monday. As Bodie Brooks shows us, park officials are trying to find new horses to live in the Hall of Champions after the park's third death in two years. With Point Givens passing, the Kentucky Horse Park's Hall of Champions now only has four residents, and none of them are thoroughbreds. Park officials have known that these horses wouldn't be here forever, but the business landscape around finding new champion residents has also changed. We'd been talking about it for some time. You know, Jen was a little bit older, Point Given was a little bit older, Funny Side was a little bit older. They were all in their mid-20s at their time of their passing. So, you know, we had begun to think about, okay, what, what happens next? For decades, the Hall of Champions has been where the cream of the crop come to live out the post-racing days. Kentucky Horse Park President Lee Carter calls them the ambassadors of the park. And they're all champions within their, their sport and uh, the great stories to tell. In terms of when we might add another one, you know, that's just going to depend. Again, we want to find the right horse, uh, the right connection, where it makes sense. Carter says for the Hall of Champions, it's about the story to tell. What made that horse unique, the career unique, the ownership unique? Those are the kinds of horses you don't come across often. We'd hoped maybe that there'd be a little bit more time between them. Um, but, you know, we, we've started having some conversations uh, and just kind of working through the, uh, a list of potential uh, residents just to, just to have dialogue. However, the horse park isn't the only player showcasing champion horses. Other private farms now do the same thing. But Carter says that's a good thing for the industry overall. We, we don't look at it as competition. You know, we look at, you know, Lexington being the horse capital of the world. So if it's good for us, it's good for them. And if it's good for them, it's good for us. But for right now, Carter says there's no set timetable on new residents. And with another horse passing, it serves as a reminder to cherish the stories of the champions still with us. At the Kentucky Horse Park, Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News.